A team from National Environmental Management Authority, NEMA, stormed Kuala District to enforce the restoration of degraded wetlands. Over 30 hectares were restored in the exercise that saw a number of trees brought down and crops smashed to the ground. Currently, it is estimated that about 38% of the total wetland coverage in Kuala is degraded. We are trying to engage them so that they let them begin to understand that it is not about NEMA. When issues of climate change come, it will not affect NEMA alone, it will affect all of us. According to officials, the first phase of the enforcement targeted 10 big shots who had extended beyond their boundaries. NEMA says they were forced to swing into action after issuing several orders. Even after giving a restoration order for him to restore the area he was not responding and for us we follow the law we are implementing the law after the 21 days we get to action if we are to succeed in the implementation of pdm for example which is production and productivity we must take into consideration the issues of what of, uh, of environmental protection, issues of climate change. And so these uh, enforcements are timely. So we have started with the top 10. The big shots included army officers, the district chairperson, and other allies members of the community. Because some of them felt untouchable. They encouraged them to be in the wetland. On top of that, these are the people who were supposed to mobilize the, to demobilize the community from the wetland. So for example, we must lead by example. This guest house at Konaboke will also have its wall fence broken down after extending its boundary over 20 meters into the wetland. Nema says the wetland is being degraded by very responsible persons in the community. They encourage communities to consider livelihood options like PDM to get out of the swamps. Ediolua, UBC News.